The dead man cometh. Making his way to the ring from Immortal. Death Valley, weighing in at 299 pounds. A decade and a half of dominance. And his opponent from West Newberry, Massachusetts. Weighing in at 251 pounds, John Cena! No matter where his match is on the card, whenever John Cena's in the ring, it possesses a big fight, main event feel. It's just another reason why Cena's known as the franchise. And I wouldn't at all be surprised if this match stole the show here tonight. John Cena is one of WWE's longest tenured veterans, but he's still got plenty left in the tank. I agree with you, Byron. There's a reason they call the guy oh. Big Match John. Oh, God, that hurt. Oh, man, right to the arm. Hyper extend your elbow. Elbow drop. Big time. Thunderous slam. Man, what a slam. Elbow finds its mark. Hooked up and... him right in the mouth. Relent. Oh, what a right. Man, that's some attitude behind it. John Cena is starting to take some deep breaths in there. Don't be surprised oh, if he man. shrugs it off and comes back more motivated than ever. Hey, you're going to absorb some punishment in a wrestling match. It just goes along with the territory. Oh, and man. he knows that. I doubt he's all that concerned. His shoulders are down. Oh, my goodness. This hurts. No early kick out. Big match John is not going to go down that easily. Of course, Extreme Rules matches have resulted in some gruesome moments over the years, and perhaps none was more gruesome than in 2012 when Brock Lesnar busted John Cena open following a vicious attack. What a stomp. Good grief. Here comes The Undertaker with a flying clothesline. As Byron mentioned, Lesnar's attack on Cena in 2012 was without question gruesome. And furthermore, I don't think I've ever seen John Cena manhandled like he was on that night. Yeah, Lesnar definitely brought it to Cena that night. But what's truly amazing is that John Cena eventually found a way to win that match. Vertical suplex! Nice! Undertaker looking mortal here. Looks like he may have let his guard down there for a moment and it cost him. The oh. good news for him is that his opponent's offense is likely packing a little less of a punch, considering all the damage he was able to inflict earlier in this match. In the lead up to WrestleMania 34, we had no evidence of The Undertaker making an appearance and despite desperate attempts by John Cena to bait him, the dead man remained in the darkness until the very last second. Elbow right to the back of the neck. Oof. Recall it. The cover. Yeah, I don't believe that, that, that he didn't win this match right there. Still too fresh. Over the years, we've come to expect these bursts of greatness from him. Goodness. That hurt the shoulder. Uh-oh. Going for the run. Choke slam. I'm not sure how much he has left. Oh, the reversal by John Cena. Without a doubt, this is a volatile situation, guys. WWE superstars are dangerous without weapons. Then you put them in an environment like this, and who knows what you're liable to see. Beautiful technique. Undertaker can sense he's got the upper hand, feeling good about his chances. 
Here we go. John Cena. Are we looking at yet another John Cena victory here? Might be too late for him, but don't tell him that. Hard to argue Michael's point on what a move. He's making a statement here with this attack. Come back. The end may be near. What a slam. Impactful. Will jar your spine. Wow, what a gritty performance. It's going to take more than that to keep him down. He may be the dead man, but Taker ain't laying down for anybody. There it is. Did you hear that? Right? Boom! What impact! This might be it! Oh my! Going for the cover. One! Two! And he's able to get the shoulder up. He may be the dead man, but Taker ain't laying down for anybody. Hooked up. Counter here. Oh boy, he is rolling. Bad spot to be in for Undertaker. There's a good chance he can't recover from this. It's time for the Undertaker to rise. Just one more time. Devastating elbow. Over the years, we've come to expect these bursts of greatness from him. Oh, we got a cover. Two. Oh, my. How in the world did he kick out of that? Might have slipped there, Cole. Uh-oh. Go for the run. Hook slam. That's how you put an exclamation point on a mat. We're going to lock it in here. We're going to lock it in here. Boom. Running STO plants him. Nicely done. Elbow drop with authority. It comes legendary Hell's uh -oh. Gate! Uh -oh. this Hell's is Gate! Bad. This is real bad. The Gogo Plot is locked in. That's what he was looking for, Michael. Oh, John Cena's in a real bad spot. Oh, what a slam! Landed him. You know, an Extreme Rules match is going to be dangerous going in. But I don't think anybody anticipated it being this dangerous. Shoulder tackle! Oh, he's able to reverse it. Here he goes. Only one place to go when you're stuck in the fireman's care. Big time slam! Vicious. This is his opportunity to win this thing. Definitely got it all that time. Big match, John strikes again. Well, they don't call it Extreme Rules for nothing, guys. Let's take another look. Check this out. Yeah, he's putting in the work. Highlight for one superstar, low light for another. And here's the last piece of the puzzle. Here is your winner, John Cena! This one's over, folks. John Cena picks up the win. The dead man has just been buried. Undertaker lost, and I can't believe it. I don't think anybody would have expected anything less from a match here at Extreme Rules. That was the absolute definition of vicious.